Okay, welcome to the Orchestra Concept Series. Um, in this episode, we're going to talk about integrations. So if you head to the Orchestra Portal, you can see integrations are so important they even have their own tab. Now, saying that you have an integration is kind of like saying you have a configuration or you have the ability to sort of have a configuration to a SaaS tool. Now, we're data people, so the SaaS tools we use aren't just any SaaS tools. Um, their data tools. And if you go to our docs, which are here, you can see that our integration list reflects that. So we have ingestion um, integrations, we have streaming platforms, we've got transformation integrations, reverse ELT integrations, and we've got a few more, which, which we should add to the docs. Um, but when you set up an integration, you know, you basically have to have, you know, an API key, um, a username, and this is like really, really important because when managing data environments, you're probably connecting with different sets of credentials. And that's important because you might want to have different sets of credentials to the same SaaS tool. Therefore, to say you have an integration to Snowflake is kind of like saying you have a username and a password and whatever else so that you can connect to Snowflake. We actually have the concept of connection within an integration, which just means you can have multiple connections to your integration. So here we see I've got a Snowflake prod connection. If I want to use Orchestra to execute operations in Snowflake that aren't in my staging environment in Snowflake, I would have to set that up separately. And you can see exactly what happened here. Um, but their integrations, you know, pretty self-explanatory. Um, it's worth noting that we only have integrations to data tools. Um, so, you know, you might also want to set up Slack for alerting. Um, we wouldn't say that you have a quote unquote integration to that. We'd say that was a, um, a connector, but um, you know, that's sort of a potato potato. But if you want to see what your connectors are, um, you can see they're here. So we'll be adding sort of support for Git and adding Teams soon, but for now, just Slack. But yeah, that is what an integration is.